I have a feeling that today Harbor Freight's going to make some of you look really bad. Now, when I say some of you, I don't mean the subscribers of this channel or the regular viewers of this channel that leave comments, thoughtful comments, comments that help other people. I'm talking about the people mostly on the short videos that this channel posts. And just let me say straight out, I can't stand short videos. Usually within the first hour of one of my short videos being posted, you got some really cool comments from the subscribers and all that. And then they just start pushing it out to people that are nothing but absolute negative people. And the only reason I continue to do them is because YouTube makes me. But that's besides the point. What I want to talk about is a short video for Harbor Freight that I posted right here. Now this post has been going crazy. I posted it a couple weeks ago. It was a short clip from a longer video that I did for this impact driver that Harbor Freight has. It's the Hercules. So the initial comments were really good. That's fine. Listen, I do not care if you like a tool or do not like a tool on this channel, but I started getting some accusations thrown at me. Somewhere I put the video in reverse and I was using special effects to let it go down through a treated six by six with no pilot holes, or I had hidden pilot holes underneath a board on top. But the best comments are usually the ones that just repeat themselves. Somebody sees a clever comment and then just repost it over and over again, hoping that people start giving it thumbs up and it reaches the top of the comment section. And the number one thing was, well, drive one more and it'll probably explode. But there was another comment that caught my eye. Do 25 lag screws the same way and then I'll be impressed. So I figured what the heck, challenge accepted. So today we're gonna do something a little bit different and, and I'm just gonna put this out here. Usually I do not care if a tool does good or not on a channel. However, today is different. I hope and pray that this impact driver does what I think it's probably going to do and put a lot of those comments to shame. I am going to set up my video camera. I am not going to edit a specific part out of the video. We're gonna run it real time. And then I am going to try and run 25 five inch, half inch lag screws down through a treated six by six with no pilot hole. And whether or not this thing bursts into flames or not, I don't know. If it does, you'll see it. But if it does well, you're gonna see it. I am not going to edit those clips. Again, I am going to play them straight through. Whatever happens, happens. And we'll let you decide how this new Hercules five-year warranty impact driver does. All right, so I am not going to stop this recording. We are just gonna go nonstop. I got all my lag screws there. I got 25 of them. Look at this. I wanna point this out right now. I got a uh, pilot hole here. I got a pilot hole here. That's a screw and a pilot hole here. We're gonna miss all those. We're gonna go in here. There's a bunch of different holes here. Remember that, we're gonna talk about that here in a bit. I just got a splinter, ouch. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I got my bit and we're just gonna start driving these down. I'm gonna start on mode three. I got an extra battery just in case. We'll do our first one. Now, of course, I'm gonna let this, you know, slow down a little bit after. So we're gonna do like a couple, I'll let it cool down. I would do that for any other impact driver. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> those sticking out so let me grab a couple more here there's another one three two one <laughs> people are like oh you had a board on here you had a board on there you you threw it in reverse you threw it in reverse it's all visual effect editing so there's three let me grab two more visual effects it wasn't real do it with this do it with that well here you go we're doing it Oh, oh, oh. oh, my 
my microphone's starting to come off. So there's one, two, three, four. Let's go five. Now this is gonna start warming up. Five, we'll bring it right here. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> Oh, I just split the wood. Oh, that's not fair. No, it's junk. Okay, so let's go right here. Just so you know, that was already there. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna bring this over here. And again, I'm not gonna stop editing. I'm gonna bring this over here for you on this other side. Here you go, right there. All right. Do it again. Not right there. Why wouldn't you want these to do well? I, I don't understand. It's it's competition. Drives the prices down. Makes other brands competitive. bring you over here. I'm hoping my camera doesn't shut off. So let's bring it over here. Let's do it on the side. Right there. Okay. There you go. Come on, catch. Catch. See, I would be editing this out in another time. This is a Harbor Freight socket. That's a Milwaukee extension. But I'll tell you what, that adapter, you gotta give those credit too, man. That's real nice, like. Come on, come on. No pilot hole. You know what, that's gonna go. That's actually gonna go into the other screw. Let's go, uh, let's go down right here. camera over a little bit more here. I don't want anybody getting upset saying I'm shutting stuff off. How many we got here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Let's get right here. Twelve. down all right so i shut the camera off and there's a reason for it oh, this is so hot that that impact driver is so hot you got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen there are 14 lag screws down through here remember the holes that i told you about a little bit ago so check these out there are 25 holes drilled my camera overheated the last time and it did not save me driving these all down. I was so upset, I, so irritated. But on top of the ones that I just said, I drove 25 other lag screws down 
without stopping. Not only that, I took them all back out with the same impact driver. Now, just to show you, these are all the legs that I drove down one after another after another the first time I did this. I use a Canon R6, and unfortunately, they like to overheat. When they overheat, instead of saving what you already shot, it just erases the whole thing. It says zero bytes on the memory card, which is really a bummer because this took me like, I don't know, 25, 30 minutes to do this. But I'm taking them all back out after I drove them down with that impact. So again, over 30 some legs driven down and taken back out. Now, the first time I did this, I used an 8AH bat ray and then a 5AH bat ray. The 8AH went completely dead. And then I still had like three bars left with this. There's a lot of tension on those lag screws right there. Or should I say friction? Yeah, friction. That's real nice lag. I mean, just look at this. In total, like 39 lag screws. No pilot holes down through a treated 6x6 with no pilot holes. That is freaking insane for this. And the only thing I noticed out of everything, out of everything, is there's a little bit of grease, which is normal because that grease gets so hot. I mean, this thing is on fire right now and it'll actually shut itself down when it gets too hot and then it'll kick back on. This thing is amazing. This impact driver is great. And you got a five year warrant with it. I don't know what else to say. And you can still see this thing works. Absolutely 100% fine. There is nothing at all wrong with it. Again, you got a little bit of grease coming out on the, the top over here by the call it, but that's just because this thing, it's not built for this. This is like a 100% torture test. And watch, after everything I just drove down, the 25, the freaking, listen, you can believe it or not, I do not care. 25 drug down, no pilot holes. And then the ones I just showed you, and then check it out. We'll just take some more out. Look, watch. So as for the comment that said, well, it dies after the first one, it clearly doesn't. You got the five year warranty on this. I don't care if you buy these or not. My most important thing is making sure that the subscribers and the viewers of this channel find the best tools for the job to make sure that they are not spending their money on junk. This is an awesome impact driver. Hercules and Harbor Freight stepped it up. I just don't understand why people don't want other tool brands to do well. At the end of the day, it creates competition. It creates competition for your favorite tool brand. So your prices don't go insane. It keeps them in check. It keeps them innovating. It keeps them getting better. It's just better around for all of us if other tool brands are successful. So the hate, maybe it's just because people are bored. I get it. But at the end of the day, this is bad ace. Oh, and by the way, just like you were seeing here, those last 25, they were non-stop. I only gave it a rest maybe every five uh, lag screws for about 30 seconds, maybe not even that, and it just kept driving and driving and driving, and really, really good job. Look, I'll take another one out. I'll go all day with that, and this is not what it's meant for. This is used and abused. This is a torture test for these things. This is so freaking hot right now and everything is working absolutely fine. Let's go to the auto mode, go in reverse, it'll stop. There you go. Now I will leave the other video, the first time I did this right here, and then another cool video right there for you to check out. If you could smash that like button, well, that'd be greatly appreciated. We'll be back with more videos soon. I gotta take the rest of these lag screws out.